2-06 State Nation Press. Okay, so this is also a conditional use request in RP zoning. Um, property is located at the corner of West 4th Street and North Coons. There's also an existing residence um, historic structure in the historic district. However, uh, what makes this one a little bit unusual, it is three conditional use requests in one application for three separate land use items, all really in a mixed use building, for lack of a better term. One is a uh, radio broadcasting studio, the other is a telecommunications tower to go with that, and the third one is a meeting facility for Snake Nation Press. Um, all within the building, except for the tower, of course, and it still be um, as a private residence. This is also in the transitional neighborhood character area, um, which with the surrounding zoning and the mixture of the land use pattern, these uses actually fit very well together. Um, I will point out that they're sort of on the small scale of the spectrum for each of those. It is a small tower, it is a very small radio broadcasting studio, a very small FM station with a range of only three miles, um, and a meeting space which is about approximately half of the floor area of the home. Um, not too much change in your packet is a copy of the proposed site plan. It will be required to put in a small parking lot in the rear yard. It will be sort of hidden from being behind the house. There's a lot of old growth vegetation on the property, which helps soften the effect. Um, and again, this also will go to the Historic Preservation Commission uh, for these changes to the site. HPC has already approved the tower, um, which will only be 59 feet tall which is not a whole lot taller than the house and sort of up in the tree canopy area. Um, floor plan is also in your packet. Here's some photographs of the site. You can see the dwelling here. Um, it's on the corner, so you see it from the two different sides, um, including the rear yard area. And then the rounded is, you know, buildings of a similar character, mixture of residential. That one actually, I think, is an office uh, where it had been converted over and some other buildings. I'm glad to answer any questions you may have on this any questions for staff? I'm just out of curiosity. Yeah. And also four conditions to go with the other one. Well, I was going to ask you about that first condition where it says 100 watts. Is that can't be changed later if they get it upgraded by the FCC or is that? I, I just didn't know how that. Correct. Was. This sort of gets them their foot in the door, and if they want to upgrade to a more commercialized radio station, then they would need to come back to the process. But keeping it low key in a more residential setting, this is what FCC has approved it for. And a copy of that approval is in your packet as well. Mm -hmm. There is conditional use and other zoning change. Okay. Correct. Matt, yeah, just curious on, on the five uh, parking spaces that you show here, is that, is that a paved or is that gravel? It's five paved parking spaces, um, more durable that way. And it's the, you know, those five are to accommodate all three of those uses. Um, the residence will still have its own driveway off of West 4th Street, which is what they're using now. And that's not required to be paid, but it is there. It really is space number six in the equation. Um, staff had to be a little creative in coming up with a parking number for this facility because it is such a mixture of things. Uh, but it's based primarily on the meeting space component, which logically <coughs> some people will be coming there. You know, not huge meetings, but a few people at a time, perhaps, so it gives room for them to park. Any other questions for staff? There being none, anybody here wishing to speak in favor of this request, please come forward at this time. Please state your name and address for the record, please, sir. Uh, my name is Paul Arambula. I'm at 110 West 4th Street here in Velasco. The uh, State Asian Press has existed uh, since 1989, and generally what we've done in the past is do uh, literature books, uh, poetry, and prose. And uh, about two years ago, we uh, decided to you know, upgrade the mission of the uh, state to include a uh, media center that would also include the radio tower and the, and we went through the FCC for approval of the low power FM station. Uh, they have very many conditions. Well, there was a question asked by one of the commissioners uh, whether we would go to a commercial and larger uh, broadcast tower and uh, the, the answer to that question is no, that we're limited by what we can do. We 
can't uh, solicit or or have any type of uh, advertising on the radio station. Primarily what we're looking for is to allow the community and access to uh, use the telecommunications, both uh, audio and video uh, studio that we'll create in the building to uh, get them more involved in processes such as this and uh, trying to uh, involve uh, people who are, let's just say, not able to access traditional means of, of uh, in the political process and, and just in news and information uh, such as churches, uh, organizations like the, uh, the, uh, the Humane Society or those kind of organizations where uh, we can give them time on our station to uh, talk about what they're doing and maybe to improve it. Our broadcast range is right around the perimeter of Valdosta. It's a three mile radius and it's very low power. Um, that's what the name says. We uh, don't expect a lot more traffic than currently uh, goes into the uh, into the building at Stink Kitchen Press. And we do expect in the future to uh, have a full-time curator on site that will act as a quasi-station uh, manager for the low power FM. Um, is there any questions from any of you all? Any questions for our presenter? Thank you, sir. Thank you. Anyone else here wishing to speak in favor of this request? Anyone here wishing to speak in opposition to this request, please come forward. Anyone wishing to speak in opposition? There being none, commissioners, any discussion amongst ourselves on this request? There being no discussion, I will ask for a motion at this time. Mr. Chairman, I'd like to uh, make the motion to set the floor of the City Council to approve the State Nation Press, file number CU2015-06, with the four existing conditions. Okay, so we have a motion from Commissioner Hall. Do I have a second? Second. I got a second from Commissioner Wild. That was good. Any more discussion on this motion? There being none this time, if you will, all, all in favor of this request, signify by raising the right hand. It's called Madam Dems 8 0. Matt, you're